What's up, YouTube? And what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke, episode number 13. In the last episode, which was yesterday, we had just finished beating Whitney, and she destroyed our team, so we, we made our way to this, where the Sudo, Sudo Wudo tree stood, um, rebuilding our team, which you can see on the layout. Uh, but if you missed yesterday's episode, make sure you go back and check that out because we did make a lot of progress. Uh, in today's episode, we're going to finish making our way to Ecruteak City, which shouldn't take too long. Uh, we're going to take on the Kimono Girls first of all, and then we're going to go to the Burn Tower, see what's going on there, and stop right before we get to Morty's Gym. Um, so if you're looking forward to today, if you're hyped for Pokemon Crystal, go ahead and hit that like button and talk to me down below. Today was Nintendo's uh, Nintendo's day to do their event, and they knocked it out of the water. And they told us some really cool stuff that's coming, and I'm super excited about it. So I want you to tell me what you're most excited about from Nintendo for the Nintendo Switch's games or whatever they talked about today at E3. Uh, and I'll be talking about kind of my thoughts on everything as we go through the episode. Uh, so that. Uh, let's go ahead and do a team recap because you did see a grinding montage right before this episode. Go up here to the top. <clears throat> First up is Drago, our ground type Diglett, the smallest member of our team, still with Ice Grip, or excuse me, Vice Grip, Ice Beam, Aurora Beam, and Flame Wheel. Um, with his stats are getting up there, his attack, his defense are good as they've always been. Next up is the red card of our team, that Sarah, the Grass Poison type. Dragonite, um, who I feel like like is good and all, but like Psychic hurts, Fire hurts, obviously, but like those types are pretty common so far, especially Psychic. Uh, but we're holding the Amulet Coin because we need to make some money so we can buy some potions and uh, and Pokeballs and stuff. But we got Scratch, Rolling Kick, Dizzy Punch, and Octazooka. Octazooka new in the last episode. Um, with pretty good stats, so you will, you, will, you will not hear me complain. Speed could be a little bigger, a little quicker, so I guess I could give this the Quick Claw, but we'll keep the Amulet Coin on. Amulet Coin, whatever. Next up is the most frail member of our team, that's Clovis, the Flying-type Swinub, with the Amulet Coin as well, because he was one of our only high levels last or in the last episode. But we have Sludge, the Broken Cut, Bone Meringue, and Mud Slap. What is happening? Spoilers. Um, with good special attack and good special defense and good defense. So overall this mod's looking pretty good Hopefully it can survive until it evolves Next up is Kenya the Sunkern the poison type Sunkern who we got from the guy like in the building between Goldenrod City and whatever the route just north of Goldenrod is <clears throat> With stomp ice punch stun spore and shadow ball no longer explosion because I almost clicked it many times I had to move it to the bottom and we got shadow ball to replace it Our stats are looking okay. I guess not too bad But if we get hit by a rock or ground or normal type move, we're probably gonna die um, so we just have to our goal with Kenya is to hold on to Kenya until it evolves and then we can go on from there I'm smelling some food in the kitchen. Uh, next up is Zivia, the fire type or fire water type muck uh, with snore, rock slide, horn attack, and ancient power, who is actually a lot more difficult than I think it should have been to grow a level or to grow levels, to grind up. Um, but our stats are looking pretty good. Defenses, especially speed, is pretty good as well. Good attack, just all around pretty good. And lastly, we have Majda, the ghost type horsey. With Protect, Submission, Dizzy Punch, and Tri-Attack. <clears throat> and pretty good stats overall. That Special Attack is pretty bad, though. But our Special Defense is pretty good. So I'm actually going to break for just a second while I go make sure that everything in the kitchen is going okay. Because I can really smell it. It's really strong. So I'll be back in just a second. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. It's just food cooking. So uh, let's go ahead and start our timer for this episode, which I meant to do before, but that's okay. Okay, my watch has the timer going to make sure I don't burn my apartment down. So that's our team. Let's go ahead and head up this way. Got some battles to take care of. Who do I want to lead? Let's have our uh, Zivia lead. All right, here we go. We got Grimer. 
What's a Grimer to a Zivia? Okay, so Grimer is, that's right. So I need to use this. I missed! Oh, oh wait. Gr Grimer's not necessarily the same typing that I am. I should have known that Rock Slide was the thing to do. Oh god, Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt sounds scary, but it does not appear to be too strong in this game. So, um, so let's start talking about E3. Um, so what did they talk about today? Man, they announced so much. Um, I guess the most important thing to me that they announced was uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild DLC Pack 1 comes on June 30th. That is so soon. I was not expecting that. I was not expecting it this soon. Is this a new route? It is a new route, isn't it? Oh, dang. So we can catch a Pokemon. All right, so we're going to heal up first. And we're going to make sure that our... Oh! All right, so we need to do a couple things. We need to do a couple things right now. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run up in this Pokemart. I'm going to check. Ah! Ah! Uh, my nose! What happened? I hope the smell isn't like messing with my nose. I think it is. That's kind of crazy. Hopefully that'll go away. We only have six super potions. Let's fix that. Let's go ahead and buy, wait, six. So we would need to buy, oh my gosh, I can't math. I can't buy 14, right? I could buy 14, but instead I'm gonna buy nine. All right, now we're gonna go back to Bill's house. Oops. Uh, we're gonna go back to Bill's house and pick up a Pokemon. Okay, now who has Stun Spore? Okay, uh, Kenya has Stun Spore, crazy enough. So our Mon is Heracross! Oh, oh, it's so exciting, I love Heracross. Heracross is one of my favorite Pokemon. So we'll Stun Spore. That's terrifying. It has Recover, Belly Drum, Recover. I guess I haven't really seen anything too exciting just yet, but. It doesn't have any attacking moves? All right, hold on. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use Horn Attack. Zivia, hold back. Okay, good. Okay, don't do this. Okay, don't do this. Ancient Power is pretty weak. Okay, catch. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Oh, not low enough. How about a Pokeball? Oh my gosh. No, not Master Ball. Come on! I just used all of these. It's about to use Skull Bash? Is this happening right now? This is gonna waste all of the time of the episode. This is crazy. Oh my goodness, stay in the ball! Oh my goodness, finally! I don't even know where my phone is. I have no idea where my phone is, so we're gonna have to go on here. That was extremely annoying. And of course, my computer is being stupid. Uh, Nothing's going well today. All right, so first name only. It is a male generate name. Okay. So we have Heracross, the single horn Pokemon, with its 
Herculean powers, it can easily throw around an object that is 100 times its own weight. That's pretty crazy. And his name is going to be... I can live with that. Rajiv. Rajiv. We'll probably say Rajiv. All right, I'm gonna have to check out Rajiv once we get back there, but we gotta go pick up a Pokemon from Bill real quick. Okay, so let's can, let's actually talk about E3 now. Um, okay, well, I guess we're already here. Oh my god, this is the third time since I started playing. Yes. Oh my gosh. So, Zelda Breath of the Wild de uh, DLC is coming, um, like... June 30th, which is extremely soon. I was not expecting it that soon, but I am going to be starting a playthrough of it. A Mag Cargo. Okay. Excuse my sniffles. I, don't, I think something in the oven. Okay, I like this name. This name is pretty cool. Uh, the food that I'm cooking must be messing with my nose. Nico Demos. All right, we have Nicodemos. Let's check him out. Nicodemos, the mag, the ghost type mag cargo with baton pass, earthquake, dragon breath, and tail whip. Okay, so that's a strong Pokemon to stay in the PC. All right, and then so we let's deposit you. Let's withdraw Rajiv. Rajiv brought an item with him. What did he bring me? TM thirty nine. Okay, so. We have Rajiv, the Ice Ground type Heracross with Soft Boiled Skull Bash, Belly Drum, and Recover. With pretty good stats overall. I'm making an executive decision. This is our new team. Yes, this is our new team as of right now. Let's see what, what uh, TM we brought me. Disable, okay, that's not too great, but can you learn Cross Chop? You can. So we're gonna get rid of, let's get rid of Recover. Okay, so now we know that. Uh, can you learn Bone Club? Can, what? Bone Club, okay. I'm actually gonna take a, a pause here for just a second because I need to blow my nose real quick. These sniffles are getting on my nerves. And then we'll be back to figure out what we're gonna do with Rajiv. I think this is the first time I've ever had to add cuts like this in. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and... Okay, we're gonna teach Dizzy Punch for sure. And we'll do Dizzy Punch over Skull Bash. All right. Now, let's go back. <laughs> all the way back. We did all that grinding with Kenya. Now, if I get a Sunstone, we might see about what Kenya will evolve into, and then Kenya can potentially rejoin the team. But uh, for now, we're gonna rock with Rajiv. All right, we are here. I could go get another encounter. I could get, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna save it, I'm gonna save it, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it, I'm gonna save it, I'm gonna save it. Let's run up in here. Defeat all the kimono girls and he will give me a prize. Okay. Um Clovis. Clovis, lead us off. Nah. Let's let it, let's let Zivia. Zivia only got like one or two battles or something. What do you think about this sped up music? Okay, so Zelda Breath of the Wild DLC. I'm so bad at talking about things during playthroughs like this. Um, so what I'm thinking is, as soon as the, the DLC comes out for Zelda, I am going to be doing uh, a playthrough of it. Uh, it'll be going up during, it'll be alternating with Digimon World 3. Uh, so that'll be exciting. You can look forward to that, especially if you're a Zelda fan. Uh, I'm so excited to play through the game again. I did finish the game. Here, here's what I need to do to be better at this. I need to turn down the music in my ear, because I'm just screaming. But, um, I did finish the game. I put in 155 hours into the game um, before I beat it the first time. 
um, just completioning 100%, almost 100%. I did not do, and I don't really plan to do the Korok seeds. I might do them in a, uh, oh, this is dangerous. I am out of here. No, 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 no. You are not going to do this to me. Magister, come out here. Yeah, you're not doing this to me. Oh, no! Was that rollout? That had to have been rollout. But of course it got a crit. I could lose somebody else right now. Okay, that didn't do anything. That did a lot, and if I missed, I was dead. Are you serious? I really kind of liked Majda. Aw, oh, man. Well, Majda. I was really excited for Majda. I thought Majda was going to be a great Pokemon. Current box is 14. Oh my gosh, hold on. Hold on. Alright, deposit Majda. Who's dead? Who's dead? Okay. Nicodemus, you come with me. We're going to box one. Deposit Nicodemus. Change back to box 14. And let's withdraw Kenya. I think that's right. I think all of these guys have died. That would make sense. That would make sense. Change box back to box one. So... Just like that, Kenya has returned. Jeez, that's crazy. All right, well, nothing we could do about it. I wasn't too attached to Magda because it was just last episode that we got it. Um, so Zelda will be coming out, and then they announced that Rocket League is coming to the Nintendo Switch, which is exciting. I'm trying to pretend like there's not an Alakazam standing in front of me, uh, but this rock slide will do... A lot. Good to know, good to know. Trying to learn Ember. Instead of Snore, I mean, why not? Alright, your level. Mom! Alright, there's something in our PC. We'll try to remember that that's there. Let's go ahead and switch to Clovis. Which is, is dangerous, but I want to spread out the attention. Alright, last one. Um, so Rocket League, we'll, I'm going to find a way to play Rocket League. This is dangerous. And there you go. Taken down. What time is it? Okay. Actually, this is about to go off. So he gave us HMO3. All right. Who can learn Surf? Whoa, stop, 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 stop. I did not mean to click anything. It's hard to know because, sir, I, I don't know what type of move Surf is. So who's hurting for an attack? I could teach it to Rajiv. I'm going to hold off for, the, for this second. I'm not going to do anything just yet. Okay. So that was the Kimono Girls house. Uh, I should, I mean, I still have everything, right? Oh, that's right. Mom sent us something. Let's see what she sent us this time. Did you send us a Master Ball? She sent us a Moonstone. I'm not upset. Also, I just realized I need to deposit stuff. I'll do that in the next episode. I'll do that before the next episode. I need to deposit some items. All right, let's go ahead and buy, wow. Let's go ahead and buy nine of these. Actually, I'm gonna buy 14 of these. Yeah, that's fine. And let's go ahead and think about it for a second. Actually, the grinding montage will probably make this up to be the last, to, to make up the time. So, 
we are going to go ahead and call that an episode. I know the last couple episodes I've said we're going to do a certain thing and we keep stopping beforehand. I apologize for that. I'm trying. I'm still trying to get the feel of how long episodes should be. Um, we're, we're aiming for 20 minutes. So I do hope you enjoyed today's episode. Today we got ourselves to Ecritique City. Um, we caught ourselves a Heracross along the way. We also acquired a med cargo from Bill. And then unfortunately we lost our horsey, our Majda the horsey, um, to a crit. There was no way I could have known that was going to happen. I probably could have been a little more safe, but I wasn't, so that's that. Um, in the next episode, we will go into the burn tower, as well as take on Morty, I think. We'll take on Morty, the gym leader, which means I have to check levels and make sure that we're high enough level. I doubt we are, so there will probably be a pretty lengthy uh, grinding montage to start the next episode. But make sure you subscribe so you can see that. And then tell me in the comments below, what was your favorite thing about Nintendo's E3 so far? I don't think they're done. I think they have one more game. Actually, you know what? By the time you see this, I just realized I've been talking about it all wrong. By the time you see this, they maybe have already announced the next game. So let me know what you think uh, in the comments below. What was your favorite thing from Nintendo's E3 this year? Or were you more excited about another game? Let's talk about E3 in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you tomorrow with another episode of Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke. Have a blessed day.